from the Family Circle Cup in Charleston, South Carolina. Patty Schneider of Switzerland has set down against Conchita Martinez of Spain. Schneider serving at 2-3 in the second set. A tight first set took almost an hour to decide. Schneider having won two of their last three encounters, but Martinez with a 6-2 advantage overall. Curiel, Paddy Schneider weaving her web once again. These two very experienced clay court players. These two know exactly what they're doing. They know every angle. They know every way to play on a clay court. Schneider with that uh, great start to the year. Appearing in her first Grand Slam semi-final in Australia. Martinez not having a particularly good year, has hired a new coach, a new psychologist, but certainly playing well here in Charleston. I think we would have really expected these two to be in the semi-final despite their clay court experience. But to me, Barry Martinez has, has found a little bit of form this week, got very comfortable on the clay. Well, she was fortunate that she didn't have to face Serena, who withdrew before their match. Yes, that was a bit of a bonus. <laughs> but then back to up with a wonderful win over Nadia Petrova. And Schneider, a good win over Davenport. And this match is everything you would expect from a classic clay court encounter. Both women very confident after the big wins in the quarterfinal. Really plot their moves very carefully out here. Oh no, she's missed it. Went for too much. So the Spaniard, who turned 32 yesterday and celebrated with that win over Petrova, on course for another final here, and she has a very fine record at this event. Twice the champion, back in 1994 and 95. Runner up as well, another occasion, and many times a semi finalist. So, South Carolina has been good to the lady from Spain. features this week of Martinez's game is how well she's been hitting the backhand, both the topspin and the slice. She's been getting very good length off the backhand topspin, keeping her opponents back, giving us some chances to bring in the slice into play and really nailing the forehand in a very aggressive performance so far from Martinez this week. And just sloppy play from Paddy Schneider. The other player, you never really know what you're going to get with Paddy. She can be brilliant, but equally she can be awful as well. How frustrating it must be to be a player like that, Not quite knowing yourself perhaps what's going to come next. Yes, by her own admission, she knows she has the ups and downs. When she's good, she's just she can really beat anyone on tour. But she's getting a little irritated here, and is it? Perhaps the, the time that Martinez is taking. Oh! And there is no love lost at the moment. She tried to hit that right through the Spaniard. Instead, it hit the net. Fortunately, it did, really. But, uh, yeah, I don't think they're on each other's Christmas card list. <laughs> Not that they were before. A little fist pump there from Martinez. Well, the crowd like it, wrapping it up. Yeah, they say, hey, this woman's tennis just gets feisty out here. <laughs> Bring it on. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, the Martino shuffle in the serve did the trick, but uh, Schneider, an angry young lady. Oh, Paddy Schneider has really lost all her mental disciplines out here. Spending way too much time worrying about Martinez. And that face really says it all. Over the years, Conchita Martinez is always a bit twitchy on court, but has got more and more sort of ticks and shuffles and ball tosses than ever before. <laughs> and it's fairly frustrating. <laughs> more time just to frustrate the Swiss player. Multi-talented athlete, Paddy Schneider, wonderful golfer. One of these players that just picks up a club and sort of birdie, birdie. And here she comes. <laughs> Doesn't walk on the lines. As she absolutely has to out here. This is where Paddy Schneider can get really dangerous. Martinez just has to be careful she doesn't allow her concentration to lapse. Schneider can be pretty defiant when she wants to be out here on court. She hits shots like that, you wonder what she's doing. Six, four, five, two down. So Paddy Schneider, who was runner up here a couple of years ago to Eva Maioli. Closes the gap by one, but still a breakdown in this second set and trailing by one set to love. Martinez in a position now to serve out for the match and book a place in the final against Venus Williams. Well work point from Paddy Schneider. Martinez just has to be careful that she doesn't get a little negative out here. Has to still keep pressing up the court. Doesn't want to let Schneider control the points. Last final was in Eastbourne last year, but it's not a regular event. But Conchita Martinez parked just outside the top 20 now. Made the top 20 last year. I think we can call that a Martinez Boomer. Wants the the Sorry, Brian. Did the same kind of thing against Petrova yesterday, I seem to remember, towards the end of the match. And again, she wants the ball with which she won the point. Yep. But the ball boys are trained now for this eventuality. 
Certainly the new coach has made a few modifications to the serve, got the ball tossed on a little bit more control. It's just allowed her the occasional free point. Turns up the pressure with the shot when she needed to. And here she stands. Double match point. For the 16th seed against the number 11. Fine play by Schneider. Some rally that. Yes, yeah, she can do it when she wants to, Paddy Schneider. Do for the first set was absolutely critical in this match. And Martina still has a way to go here. What's happened here? Just remember against Petrova? Petrova didn't give it to her. Martinez had to play again on match point. Well, it was worth a look. Obviously, if it had been called in, that would have been the end of the match because it was an unreturnable serve. A lot of love lost on the women's tour at the moment between some of the top ones. <laughs> like that. Really Schneider it does. 6-4, six, 6-3, six, the final score. And that is what Schneider thinks of it. Martinez not impressed by that either. And neither are many in the crowd. Well, there we go. I'm afraid the language heard as well. And real confrontation between these two players. Some applause, but many more who are displeased by that. 6-4, six, 6-3. Six, but it will be those comments at the end that overshadow the contest. Martinez through. She'll be back on court for Sunday's final against Venus Williams, and de deservedly so, Sam. Yeah, it was a real shame to end the match like that. Schneider, well... While... Just one of those players that just digs herself a big hole from time to time. Great to see Martinez back in a final. I think it'll be a fascinating match against Venus Williams. A real test for Williams, not a foregone conclusion. And don't write this woman off for the French Open. She's not done yet. Indeed. 32 years old. Conchita Martinez, spring chicken compared to Martina Navratilova, who entered this event, didn't go that far. But uh, for Conchita, sitting pretty there. A place in the final assured for her now. And Venus Williams will take her on for this title. Is it going to be Spain for the third time? Martinez winning this trophy for the first time since 1995. We shall see. We will be there. Join us again on Sunday's late night for the final here on Eurosport. <laughs>